Hello everyone, it's Kent here. This is my quick simulation review of SmackDown, July 26th. SmackDown started off with the Raw Money in the Bank All-Star winner Randy Orton going one-on-one -on -one against the SmackDown Money in the Bank winner Damian Sandow. In the middle of the match, Cody Rhodes came out and stole Damian Sandow's briefcase. Randy Orton hit RKO on Damian and picked up the win. Next moment. Then CM Punk came out and he talked about his match against Brock Lesnar at SummerSlam. He got interrupted by Fandango and he hit Fandango with a go to sleep. Next moment. The primetime players and Wade Barrett teamed up to take on Mark Henry and the Usos. At the end of the match, Mark Henry hit the world's strongest slam and they won the match. Next moment. Then Alberto told Wiki backstage that since John Cena got to choose his opponent for SummerSlam, Alberto deserved the same opportunity. Next moment. Rob Van Dam went one on one against the World Heavyweight Champion Alberto Del Rio. In the middle of the match, Alberto pretended to be hurt, super kicked Rob Van Dam, and then he picked up the win by being a coward. Next moment. Then the Divas champion AJ talked about not being psycho and being normal. Then Dolph Ziggler came out and told her that everything in that ring is replaceable. And AJ started to cut his credit cards, driver license, and passport with a scissor. Then when AJ went out of the ring, Caitlyn came and speared AJ, and Dolph Ziggler hit the famouser on Big E. Next moment. Then the White family had their in-ring debut against Tensai and Brodus Clay. And of course they won the match. After the match, Bright Wyatt came into the ring and hit a spinning complete shot on Tensai. Next moment. Damon Sandow was still looking for the briefcase Cody Rhodes took earlier. Next moment. Captain Charisma Christian went one on one against the real American Jack Swagger. In the end of the match, Christian hit the kill switch and he continues his role when he got the win. And the final moment is here. Then Damon Sandow finally found Cody Rhodes, he was standing beside the Gulf of Mexico with Damon Sandow's briefcase. Sandow said that Cody's facial hair was much better than his, and Cody said, oh, that's more like it. But now I'm gonna throw the briefcase in the water, and that's what he did. Then Damon said, help, I can't swim. And then he jumped into the water and climbed up a ladder. Show over. If you want, you can check out my Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Also, if you want to check my Playthrough channel out, then click the annotation on the screen, or check the link below. Thanks.